I love peripherals with Talon, and one of the first thing I got was the foot switch. The one I'm using is called Olympus RS31H, and it has four buttons. It's quite sturdy, well built, and feels really solid. And what I really like about it is its button orientation. That it actually has one button above and below, the one labeled top and center in the picture down to the left. And the reason I like that is because I use top and center to scroll up and down. It feels really natural that I can just rock my foot back and forth and put pressure either on the front of my foot or further back and it just scrolls up and down. I also have a bit of an acceleration turned on here, so the longer I hold it down, the faster it goes. I also have it set up so if I hold it down, it stops immediately as soon as I let go. But if I just press it once, it's actually a toggle. So that's the primary use case. The secondary is that I use the right button to turn my eye tracker on and off. And I use that to be able to hover over tooltips and pop-ups and stuff like that. Drowse. Same here, if I hold it down, it will revert uh, as soon as I let go, but if I uh, just press it a single time, it's a toggle on or off. And then the fourth button, the left button, I use normally to go back. Drowse. And when I'm in uh, voice applications like uh, Discord or Teams or similar, I use it as a, a mute toggle. Uh, and I must say, I couldn't live without my foot switch. If you don't have a foot switch or some kind of, you know, gamepad, adaptive controller or something like that, scrolling is really painful. Um, so I must say that a uh, hundred bucks for a good foot switch if you have the ability to use your feet is a really good investment uh, with Talon. And that's about it. Stop recording.